Hey, how's it going guys? Perdix here and welcome to episode 9 of Ascending to T90s. And in the background there, I just got... Wait for it there, 95 Dungeoneering. So now we have access to the Garage of Horde Stalker Dungeon. Uh, free Divine Locations per day, that's gonna be pretty nice, but uh, tons of loot in this video, so please enjoy. Hey, hey, there's 90 cooking, that's another 90 off the list. And also unlocks the chef from ports, I believe. Uh, so just cooking up some food. Just about to do a full raid, I think. So uh, incoming loot. So Beastmaster loot coming up first. See what we got here. We got some very decent alcables and some logs. That'll help with that uh, 99 fire making push, I suppose. Yakamaru loot time. And kind of a bad loot this time. I uh, didn't really get anything that I really wanted. Would have rathered food or something, but uh, quite a bit of techie and a burial charm, so uh, we will take that loot. Number six of the day, just about reset, so I should get a bunch more kills. So let's see what, what we're gonna get from this one. Hey, Onyx Bolts, that's a decent drop if it's not a leg or, or a hilt. First kill of the day on 2 3, so this is gonna be a good day. Let's see what we're gonna lead off with. And more coal. If you can hear my furnace behind me, but I just got a sub eight minute uh, Rax kill, so that's pretty good. Let's see if I get rewarded for that. And plate bodies and oil flasks, flasks are decent, I guess. All right, second kill of the, or maybe this is third, I can't even remember. But let's see what we're gonna get. Ah, uh, there's my third dress killing fragment that makes a full one. Fifth kill, I think, of the day. Let's see what we're going to get from this one. <sighs> Try to kill him one. Wow. All right, guys. Probably my final kill before I go do something else here. But let's see. Come on. I need something here. And uh, six magic seeds. I guess we'll take that. That's some uh, decent farming XP. Next uh, elite clue all done here. So let's... Click this X and see what's inside. Hopefully something good. And hey, cat staff. <laughs> I uh, I think I might need that, but other than this, it's a pretty shitty clue reward. Um, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and reroll. There's no really reason why I wouldn't. So uh, let's see. Come on, die. Pay off for me for once doing a reroll. I'm like I'm seriously done. Like. Oh my! For something a bit different to do for bossing, and I thought uh, I only have two items from uh, DKs, and that's something I would kind of want to revisit. I need a Zerker ring, Seer's ring, and Archer's ring, I believe. Uh, may as well get the full set from here and uh, get some uh, placeholders and stuff. So we got our first beam, but it's uh, Earth Talisman. Uh, drop 32 Earth Talismans. Uh, I'm not sure if that's gone up with uh, bonus XP or something, but uh, it's kind of a trolley beam. Rune hatchet. Hey. There's a second dragon hatchet. That's something, at least. Something to keep me a bit motivated, so that's pretty awesome. Let's uh, keep going here, see if we can get some uh, unique items. Hey, there we go, guys. There's a Sears ring. I didn't have that before. Um, not sure if I'll <laughs> really find much use out of it, but... Uh, we got it at least, and that's all I really wanted. Hey, free lamps from this book. Let's put it into fletching, I guess. That's kind of what I'm working towards right now, so yeah, why not? 23k, we will take that. Guys, so it's the last um, day before 2-3 uh, resets and goes into 1-3, I want to say. So I think I'm going to try to use this pheromone. I have three of them, so I may as well use one of them. Uh, push for another seven kills or six kills today and uh, hope for a hilt so uh, let's go ahead and do a few kills another new personal best 741 that's pretty good so let's see what the loot's gonna be from kill number one and we're gonna get some lana dimes ready kill number two uh, we've been a while without anything not quite as many as most people but I think it's been let's see did I keep it in my notes here uh, okay, I guess it's only, it hasn't been that long. I, I lied. <laughs> Never mind. Let's see what we got here, though. Water talismans. Uh, if I didn't have, wait, can I, like, take these? 
Oh, okay. I think you could like take them and then roll. Because <laughs> I wanted those. The next kill. Come on, Rexor, give me something here. You logs. Hey! <laughs> Another Pharaoh. That's funny. I, I was going to do a silent uh, loot there. Made back my pheromone, I guess, so uh, nothing was lost. That's my fourth pheromone. This um, Triskelion, crystal Triskelion key that I got from Rax. Well, let's see what we're going to get. Uh, I got my Ring of Wealth on Dragon Pick or something. <laughs> let's see. Elite Plus. Uh, okay, this takes so long. Uh, or Adamant or Coal. That's pretty. That's a pretty bad job, but let's go do this uh, Elite Glue Scroll. This is my last rock to add uh, to the statue. I'm not sure what happens after this. There we go, 7k, and that is the last one. So I guess it's just going to blow up, and then I do it again. Um, I guess I don't get anything from that. Okay, uh, that must be like a comp wreck or something, but uh, let's go get those rocks again, I guess. Guys, first loot of the day of 1-3. Let's see what we're going to get. And hey, seven magic seeds. We can't complain with that. That's uh, some good XP. Okay, second kill of the night. Let's see what he's gonna give me here. And more black dragon hide. Kill number three. Come on, hilt or top leg or both. Let's see. Uh, battle staves. And we got ourselves another beastmaster loot. So let's see what we got this time. And uh, almost the same as last time, to be honest. <laughs> the elks. Another burial charm. We're. Uh, Racking in that rep. It's finally come. God Wars Dungeon 2 is finally out. Uh, this is looking pretty cool so far. I think this is kind of the starting area. And I'm guessing this is uh, the different factions on the map that I can see here. Uh, so I just got a bounty from this guy to kill Saren members. So I guess I'm going to go try the big bear guy first, Hellweir. Uh, so let's see how that goes. I have no clue where anything is right now so uh i'll get back to you oh here's some people okay here we go saren warriors so this is where i'm going to be killing saren i guess and let's find out where these boss rooms are this is pretty awesome you're just like fighting these saren guys and then these ancient warriors just storm in and start clearing them out it's actually really cool how they're just running around there's all this dynamic fighting and everything Really liking this on first impression. There's like these platforms you can come up on and stuff. It's pretty cool to be honest. This out if you uh, get a pretty good kill killing spree up, you get a multiplier of 300%. So I'm guessing that means that every kill counts as three kill counts. So I'm at 70 kill count already, and you can share with uh, anyone around you, even Iron Man. So that's pretty nice. There's 73 from one kill. Let's see if I can tag. No. Yeah, that's kind of scary. These just groups of uh, enemies just run out. I think that's from these ingression fragments. When you get 100, you can summon them, and I guess they come to your aid. It's kind of cool. Um, I guess that would kind of help with uh, kill count. But, uh, yeah, this is kind of cool. I'm just about to go in. Let's try my first Saren boss kill. I uh, could fail miserably, because apparently this is one of the harder ones. But uh, let's see. Traverse... Uh, I guess we'll go standard, just to get the hang of it. Uh, standard spawn speed, okay. Uh, okay, let's uh, let's go in here. Okay, first Hellwear solo, uh, and we get some rune bars. Uh, Eleven rune bars, two seals, and uh, some reputation. That was that was a bit difficult because I had no clue what I was doing there. So uh, uh, it'll get easier from here. But now that I know the mechanics and stuff, you pretty much just run away from stuff. He does mechanics a lot, actually, like, really frequently. I was kind of surprised. But let's see if I can get another kill here. Holy, okay. <laughs> so we got our next kill. Grimy Dwarf Weeds. And one more seal. Uh, so now that I know the mechanics, it's, uh... I'm just gonna hop out here, because, embarrassingly enough, I'm out of food. Um... There we go. Uh, so yeah, three three attacks, and then he uses a mechanic. Um, four mechanics. So yeah, once you get used to it, it's not as bad, but uh, it's kind of difficult with this uh, level 80 weapon uh, and solo. So I think 
I'll either just duo this guy or wait till I have a T90. Uh, but I might go try some uh, different ones now. Finish that bounty. Let's see what this is going to give me. Hand in bounty. Uh, here's your reward. 150 reputation for zeros. Nice. Increased chance at... Uh, oh. Increased chance to rare items. That's kind of cool now. Uh, yes, I'd like a bounty. Um, I guess I will go with Saren now because I want to kill someone else. Okay, I gotta kill Slisk now. 